Okay, in this video we're going to go over how to change a username in WordPress. It seems to be a very common question that comes up um, often for me. And uh, what I'd like to do is just, in this Tips by Chris video, is to just show you briefly how to change it because uh, everybody thinks that's actually something you can't do. So basically log into your WordPress and you want to go to your dashboard. From your dashboard, you're going to go into the section where you see your users. You can go to all users and you'll see a list of it. Now, right now we only have the admin, which is me. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to want to change this admin username to something else. Now, first of all, if you want to just change how the post name is, like for right now, if you go to a post, we'll open this in a new tab, it's by Mr. Tips and people want to have their, it, sometimes it says admin, sometimes it has their first name, they don't want their name. If you just want to change it so that this is actually something else, you can do that by simply editing a user and filling in the blanks here. So for instance, I put Chris. So if I put Christopher and um, Tips and then Mr. Tips, and what happens is in this display name publicly, whatever is in these fields will then fill in here. So you can actually just then select, I want to be actually Mr. Tips or I want to be Chris. Now if I hit Chris and I hit Update Profile, we'll go to this View page. When I refresh it, you'll notice that this changes from Tips to now Chris. And it goes through all of my posts that I've had before. And vice versa, let's go ahead and I'll show you that again. If I change it to um, Tips Christopher, I hit Update Profile. Take note that this is Chris right now, but let's go ahead and refresh this and you'll notice that it changes to Tips Christopher because that's what I ch chose as my display name publicly. Now a lot of people want to change the username for for login purposes or for some other reason and the way you're gonna do that the easiest way to do it you can go into the database but the best way to do it is you're gonna add a new user and you're gonna go ahead and give the, news, the username you want so let's say I'm gonna be new admin man okay and we're gonna just put in just an email there and we're gonna say uh, for first name last name and I don't need a website there and we're just gonna go ahead and put in a password there and we're gonna make this person another administrator because this is how you change the administrator password okay from there what you can then do is you're gonna put add a new user and the new admin is here. Now what you then do is you're going to delete this original admin test. You're going to basically log out of this user. So you can just go to the top of your screen here and just go to log out. And then you're going to log in as the new user. So that was new admin and then we'll put the new password and because that person is an administrator then what you do you need to log into the new person that you made an administrator because you cannot delete yourself but now as the new admin see I can't delete myself I'm logged in as me but I can delete the other admin okay so you delete that person and what you're gonna do is you're gonna all the posts that that person did you're gonna then change all the posts to be under the new admin or the you know the new name and that what that does is it then changes that over so you're going to confirm the deletion here attribute it all to the new person the other one is gone now this is the new admin and what you do is if you refresh this you'll notice that this is going to change to the new admin person now I don't like the name new admin so again what we can do is we can quickly change that by clicking here and I want to show as F name no I don't like any of that let's go ahead and put down new boss boss and we will then notice that under the drop down that's going to be what's going to show up and hit update profile go to the page we'll refresh it and it shows that I'm the new boss that did the post so that's how you can do that there if you want to change it there if you have any questions please please feel free to email me at chris at tipsbychris.com or post a comment in the bottom and uh, I'll get that comment and I'll be able to do it. If there's any tips that you'd like to see, like I said, please let me know. Email me at 
chris at tipsbychris.com, and thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like us as well. Thanks.